Good evening. Cincinnati is mourning a medical icon tonight. Dr. Odell Owens, a pioneering fertility specialist and former county coroner, died this afternoon at the age of 74. And tonight we're speaking exclusively with two of Dr. Owens' longtime friends. But first, we want to go to Luke Jones with a new development from the Board of County Commissioners. Luke, good evening. Good evening, Kyle. And we just got word that Hamilton County Commissioners are drafting a resolution to name the coroner's building in Owens' honor. It's a fitting tribute given he led the coroner's office for almost six years. And that's not the only way he's being remembered tonight. The flags outside City Hall at half staff tonight. One final nod to a local legend. This is a major, major loss for us. Dr. Odell Owens died from a heart attack on his way to the hospital just after noon. In his 74 years, he wore many hats from fertility doctor to Hamilton County coroner to president of Cincinnati State. As the coroner, I told young people, get educated, stay out of trouble. And Owens devoted just as much of his time to steering people onto the right path as he did to medicine. Showing people what you can do with hard work and perseverance. The current coroner, Dr. Lakshmi Samarco, first met Owens in 1984. She was a student in one of his classes at UC Medical Center. He was an amazing speaker. He obviously knew his stuff. He was very confident. It's that reassuring presence Hamilton County Commissioner Alicia Reese will miss most about her lifelong family friend. For me to lose a, a, a friend, a confidant, a family, someone always pushing and encouraging. From a hard scrabble upbringing in the West End, Owens went on to graduate from Yale before returning to his hometown to embark on a medical career, a career marked by many firsts. In 1982, he founded UCMC's in vitro fertilization program and brought about the city's first ever in vitro birth. He also achieved the first pregnancy from a frozen embryo. When you see the Dr. Fauci's and of the world, I think of Dr. Odell Owens right at that same level. In 2004, he was elected Hamilton County coroner. In doing so, he became the first African-American elected to countywide office. It really paved the way for a lot of us afterwards who look different, who sound different, whose names are very different. And Owens also briefly served as Cincinnati's health commissioner. He then spent the next four years as CEO of Indirect for Health. He retired just last year. Kyle? All right, Luke, thank you so much. And a huge outpouring of love and support for Dr. Owens and his family tonight. Interact for Health released a statement saying, quote, Dr. Owens took care of our community from cradle to grave. He was a trailblazer, a leader, a friend, and a mentor to many. Cincinnati Preschool Promise says we mourn the unexpected loss of Dr. Odell Owens. Cincinnati Preschool Promise chairperson and founding board member, Dr. Owens was a tireless advocate for children, families, and educational equity.